It's fact. Shark attacks are feared on a higher level than almost any other danger known to humanity. Even though they aren't frequent, and your mortality is at greater risk in your car or on a plane than it is from the teeth of a great white. Nothing is more terrifying than the thought of jaws clenching around your stomach deep out in the ocean. And for those who think swimming casually in waters where sharks could lie is no big deal, ask some of these people what they think. Here we count down some of the most vicious shark attacks in known history. Because, you know, there are still many we may never know about. Number 8. Instant Regret Best friends Fry and Cliff were diving off the coast of California one fateful afternoon. The rest played out like a horror film. Fry dove in, and seconds later, a shark ripped through him deep below. Cliff, back on the boat, and unaware, would later describe the sensation of the shark's movement to police as if a boat has driven by. When a fin then emerged from crimson red waters, Cliff knew it was time to get out of there. Fry's body was found the next day without his head. Number 7. Speed In 1974, the year before Jaws debuted on the big screen, Terry Manuel was diving off the coast of Australia. He was caught. Launch from the water. Terry's friend Talbot, on the nearby boat, leaned overboard to try and grab Terry's arms. After tugging at Terry's arms while the shark sank its teeth into his legs, Talbot was successful in pulling Terry up onto the boat, but at only half his original size. The shark had managed to sever a leg. Unfortunately, Terry died before they could get to a hospital. Number 6. Testing the Waters David was a 20-year-old bodybuilder swimming off the coast of South Africa. Coincidentally, National Geographic was also in the area filming their show Shark Men. What happened next was just a matter of poor timing for David. National Geographic, in order to attract sharks to be filmed, began dumping chum into the water off the coast. Within days, the water was swarming with huge influx of sharks. When David jumped in the water, little did he know he was asking for it. His body washed up to the rocks, where his family sadly had to wait for paramedics to arrive. There had been no shark attacks in the area for 13 years. Number 5. Escape Pod Todd Endress is probably the luckiest shark victim on this list, because he survived to tell his story. A great white shark caught up to his surfboard and ripped Todd under the water. But before the shark could do its worst, Todd experienced what could only be called divine intervention. A pod of dolphins attacked the shark and formed a protective wall around Todd, allowing him to escape. Todd's back was torn and his leg was slashed to the bone, but he lived to see another day thanks to a pod of dolphins. Number 4. Gone Too Soon Up-and-coming surfer Elio Canestri was 13 when he was attacked by a shark. He was barely rescued from the water and did not make it back to shore alive. What's heartbreaking is that, before he left to go surfing, he left a note to his mother that read, I'm going surfing. If there's no security, I won't surf. A highly regarded young surfer and trusted child, Elio's story hits you right in the stomach. Number 3. Breaking and Entering Long, long ago in 1909, in waters far, far away, a French liner ship crashed into a British steamship off the coast of Singapore due to heavy fog. The French liner was packed with people, and the ship sank almost immediately. As people raced on the top decks to make it to the British steamship, the cracks in the hull below let in some vicious and unwelcome visitors. It's estimated that over a hundred people, including the captain, succumbed to the merciless sharks. Number 2. Even in Shallow Waters Newlyweds Ian and Gemma decided to honeymoon in the beaches of Seychelles. While Gemma relaxed on the beach, Ian grabbed a snorkel and drifted just feet away. Still perfect in each other's sights, a shark came up in the shallow water and bit into Ian, taking his arm in one of his legs. Ian was close enough to be rescued immediately, but it was clear that he had died instantly. Number 1. The Real Jaws Henry Borse is famous for his shark attack. Captured on film in 1964, the attack predates Jaws by 11 years. While swimming with seals off the coast of Australia, what started with smiles turned to screams when Henry was attacked by a shark. Losing his leg, miraculously, he was pulled onto his group's boat 
and then radioed ahead his blood type. Henry would later recount sticking his arm in the shark's mouth and bashing its eyes to get his leg free. The footage of the attack would later be used on a documentary called Savage Shadows. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe. Know of any other shark attacks? Let us know in the comments. The moral of this story here is, be careful off the coast of Australia. In fact, be careful everywhere, as shark attacks can happen in shallow water as well as the deep. Whether you're a surfer or a casual snorkeler, always keep an eye out, or you might lose your life. Check back for the next video, and thanks for watching.